and beautiful people. Now, I made a promise to all of you. I said, so literally, so many of you have been recommending Chainsaw Man endings over the last few weeks since it's been running on TV. And I literally said to all of you, no, I'm not going to jump on the bandwagon. I'm not going to just react to them the second they come out. I don't want to do that. How about the second they are all out, the second every single Chainsaw Man ending is out, we do one big video where we react to every single one of them. Well... Little guess what we're going to do today based on the title and the thumbnail and the fact that the video is really long and I'm sitting right here talking about that. We're going to react to every single Chainsaw Man ending in one big video. Now, I've got to admit there are a couple on here I am very, very, very excited to hear. I mean, the TK one stands out for me a little bit considering how much of a fan I am of TK. The fact that TK, with his higher note, beautiful voice, did a Chainsaw Man ending. I'm so excited to hear how that goes down. I've re I think I've listened to like a couple of these because you guys are recommending. They're all on YouTube, already um, already up as a uh, reaction, so don't worry. But man, I'm going to shut up. I am dying to listen to this. I've been waiting for so long, and I can also tell all of you here right now that at the moment we are doing a Patreon exclusive reaction to Cyberpunk Edge Runners. Um, we're going to be doing the second episode tonight, and that's going to be continuing every week until we finish the series, every Friday. When we finish Cyberpunk Edge Runners on Patreon, my new exclusive Patreon reaction will be Chainsaw Man. It has been a fan requested one for so long, and due to the fact it's not really YouTube friendly, I think you all know why <laughs> it has to sort of be a Patreon reaction. So that's what we're going to do. I just wanted to let all of you know. Links to everything is in the description. Also, make sure you subscribe because at 300,000 subscribers, I'm going to be giving one of you a thousand dollars, and at 500,000 subscribers, I'm going to be giving one of you ten thousand dollars. No, I'm not joking. Let's jump into my first time ever reaction to the Chainsaw Man ending. ending song is so fucking epic man i have heard this one before so good so good i am so excited to watch the show that is chainsaw man man i can't wait to watch it it looks so fucked up i can't wait zombies in this universe man this show looks so messed up i can't wait to watch it it looks so brilliant it looks so gory and weird and crazy and wacky it looks like everything i love in a show Right, now I've heard that one before, that's ending one. We have 11 more to go, so get comfy! This is gonna be a long one. Right on. Some slap baits. I haven't heard this one. Are they going to do this for the second season as well, where they're going to have like a different artist write a song for the endings? Has any anime ever done this before? This is incredible, because even this one, like, I think what you're going to end up with, because I haven't heard, I've heard two endings, that one and one more. I think what you're going to end up with, if I'm not going to be mistaken by the end of this reaction, is you're just going to end up with 12 songs that are 10 out of 10s. <laughs> I'm 
just need none. Oh, I need a cup of tea right now. <laughs> Who this reminds me of? This vocalist sounds really familiar. Like Ama, maybe? Is it Ama Riona? Ama Riona? I think it's Ama. It kind of gives me like Minami, maybe? Minami? I haven't done a Minami reaction in a minute, man. I need to change it. Ending two, absolutely loved it. Is this is ending three the Myth and Royd one I've reacted to? I think it is. Man, these socks are so good. Ah, so excited. I'm so excited. I'm not, I'm like, I hope you guys can tell. I am actually really excited to hear all these. I have been I've been waiting for so long. Literally, all of you watching this have been just fucking messaging me, leaving like following me on Twitch, commenting me, and just being like, "Yo, Chainsaw Man, Chainsaw Man," and I was like, "I have to wait till it's done. I have to wait till it's done. I'm gonna do all of them in one video." And the second that last episode went up, people were like, "It's done. It's done. We won the big video. What well, you've got it here." It is. Happy New Year! This is the Myth and Royd one, right? Wait, no, it wasn't Myth and Royd. It wasn't Myth and Royd. It was another band. Oh, fuck, I forgot the name of the band. This is another band I love. It's not Myth and Royd, though, is it? Maximum the hormone, that's the name of the band, it just came to me. <laughs> so much man heavy on the bass old school metal My guess, because I don't actually know what Chainsaw Man's about, no one spoiled it for me. Please don't spoil it for me. I don't know anything about the anime or the manga. Um, so my guess is literally somehow he swallows this teddy bear chainsaw and that turns him into Chainsaw Man. <laughs> That's literally my guess. I don't know who this devil is. Ah, I forgot that was the end of it. Man! Right, that is it. That's the only two ones I've heard. The Maximum of the Hormone one and uh, the Vaughn D one. The only two I've heard. I haven't heard any of the others. So, here we go. <laughs> Toby next. End of the four. distracted by this one because I need to pause it obviously a few times for copyright reasons that's why I'm doing it and I was literally just watching the spinning thing in the bottom right corner I was just like oh now she's dressed as this oh now she's dressed as that and I was just like oh yeah what the hell I should probably pause <laughs> oh man I don't know who Toby is um but loving the vibe of this one as well very wacky very strange very fast paced <laughs> That's a question I've got. Did different, um, like, did, did the same animation studio and the same people work on every single ending, or did different people take like different cracks and have fun with it? Like, 
Or is it just the songs that were different, like different artists? The animation is actually incredibly well done. Even that subtle scene just then, even the like that the uh, even the ending four, um, when she was spinning around in a circle, the way her like jumper was like naturally falling down her shoulders and she like flicked it back up, so realistic, like. Like I know, I know a lot of people would be like, yeah, but, but it was, it was really realistic. That was very cleverly done, very cleverly animated. Right, ending five. <laughs> This is fucking awesome! What the fuck? Even the animation is incredible! Uh, Sayudo? Sayudo? I'm probably butchering that pronunciation. I do apologize. Is that the name of this artist? <laughs> what? This is amazing. Man, I'm going to discover so much new music for these endings. <laughs> All of these endings just feel like a fever dream. Oh, that was it? I thought it was going to kick off again. Yeah, all of them feel like a fever dream. That's crazy, because there's no chapters in this video or anything. I don't actually know when the songs are going to end, so it's just based off feel. Um, I liked that one. That was definitely one of the one of my favorites. That was a good one. So far, the only one I wasn't too... The only one I wasn't, like, losing my mind over would be the Toby one. All the others have been excellent. Toby was a bit softer and a bit more unusual for my likings. All the others I've absolutely loved. Um, Canaria. Canaria? Can? Canaria. Canaria. Is that, is that, is that how I pronounce this one? Chainsaw Man ending. Six. Halfway through. The thing I keep wondering is the two other people he's with, the girl and the guy, the guy with the sword and the girl with the horns, um, we haven't really seen them do anything in the op like the endings or the opening. Um, they don't really do anything, so do they have the same power he has? They have similar power or are they just two random people that follow him around? <laughs> It's just like a fucking fever dream every single time. Is that supposed to be a bullet it keeps cutting to as well? Wait, was she naked just coming with the face? Oh, yeah. Yep, 
Yeah, she's butt naked cuddling with... No, she's cuddling with a cat. For some reason, I thought she was cuddling with the chainsaw. Teddy is just completely naked. <laughs> I like that. I like the wackiness, like electronic funk vibe we had to that one as well. Man, this is so cool. I love that they got in this many artists to write the endings to this many different songs. I don't know, like, I'm so new to the world of anime. I don't know if this is, like, normal, but for me, this is, like, the first time I've experienced this, and it's so cool. Anno! Anno is a name I've heard before. I don't know if I've heard many songs by Anno, but I've definitely heard the name before. I was just getting like distracted. <laughs> Every now and then I literally just get sucked into it. Because I haven't watched this anime, I'm just like, ah. Oh. And I get like sucked into what I'm watching. I'm like, oh, what's going on? What's going on the story? Every every now and then. Real I love Anno's voice. I love the higher style she has to her singing. It's absolutely beautiful. I think I've heard a couple of songs by her before. I don't know which ones, but I definitely know the name. I've definitely heard at least one song. Uh, but really love the style of it. Very unusual as well, with, like the heavier, fast stuff we've seen. But it fits well, like, for me at least, I feel like this fits well in with the Chainsaw Man songs we've heard so far, even because it is so different. <laughs> cutting to people in their underwear in like suggestive positions did something happen this episode was this a cheeky episode was there cheeky stuff happening this episode because it kind of feels like it's a cheeky episode <laughs> Just random shots of food at the end. Like, half-naked women the whole way through. Some really weird trippy scene with some rainbow-coloured stuff. And then, everyone eat! Cheers! <laughs> Fucking love it. It's amazing. I love it. That one was that one was brilliant. That one was brilliant. I want to hear more from Anna. I don't feel like I've heard enough. I want to hear more. Like that one a lot. Yes! 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 <laughs> yes! Yes! I've been waiting for this one for so fucking long. Yes! Yes! Ending 8. I wasn't sure if it's 8 or 9. I'm so excited. I'm so fucking excited. I love TK. Right, here we go. <laughs> this is heavy for TK. Now, I've heard TK scream in songs before, but I've never heard TK sing or scream over an instrumental this fast-paced and insane. This is, this, this is a different fucking side to TK I haven't seen before. Insane, man! Insane! And TK! 
In my opinion, TK has one of the best ranges vocally in Japanese music. Absolutely fucking incredible. I had no doubt in my mind this song was going to be awesome. And man, it is. I can't wait to hear the full version. You can guarantee there's going to be reaction coming soon to the full version of that song. Awesome. Ah, the next one's Aima. Yes. <laughs> I forgot Aima did one. The next one's Aima. Aima deep down. Ah, oh, man, I'm being so spoiled here. <laughs> this is so good. Ah, uh, yeah. Right. Let's jump into Aima. <laughs> If anyone does one of those like timestamp comments uh, and you take the time to like do a timestamp comment, I'll pin it. Um, so just let me know and I'll, I'll pin it. I'll get it sorted out. Oh man. Oh man. Amos voice is just fucking incredible. It's just incredible. Almost feels like a Bond soundtrack when Aima starts singing. Only Aima could turn something as crazy, wacky, and wonderful as Chainsaw Man into James Bond with that voice. Like, fuck, fuck me. <laughs> I can tell all of you right now, I'm going to be doing a reaction to TK's song, the full one. How would you guys feel about a double bill reaction? If I do a reaction to Aima and TK in one video, would you guys like that? Aima's deep down full version and TK song. I'm going to be honest, I have massive bias towards TK and Aima. Um, love them both. So I really want to hear the full versions of these songs, big time. So let me know, would you guys like a double bill? People want. No, no, people want. This just looks like the trippiest, most weird and wacky thing I've ever seen, man. Chainsaw Man, I've never in my life seen anything like this. Just from the endings and, and the opening that we've checked out so far, I honestly cannot compare this to anything I've ever seen in my life. It's just nothing. That's a good point, actually. We haven't seen the little chainsaw teddy bear in a while.
violence. That felt like it matched the craziness that was Chainsaw Man, and with that sort of like, I don't even know, I don't even know what genre you give that style of music because it's completely unusual to me. It's not, it's nothing new, but it matches like Chainsaw Man very well. We've only got two more endings left, and we are done. Wow, this reaction has just flown by. <laughs> it's crazy. I can't believe I've been, I've been screen recording for 25 minutes. It does not feel like that at all. Oh, man. The endings to Chainsaw Man. The fact that they brought in a new artist to do it every single one of these. It's just awesome. If they do that for season two, ah. Oh, I can't wait to watch this fucking show! Every now and then I literally just get sucked away with a song and I don't, I don't, I don't even, I forget that the pause button exists and I'm just loving it. This, this is my kind of song. Whenever a song has like, it's heavy on the bass in the background and with the beat as well. Um, it's something that I just vibe to. This, loving this one already. This is a really good one. I have no idea what this anime is about. I don't even care. first few endings we saw a lot of like hacking people into pieces with the chainsaw dude and uh, we haven't really seen much of that recently. It feels very different now. That is it. That is it. That's all the endings done. I'm going to stop that. I'm joking. There's one more to go. Here we go. Uh, Eve. Eve. A name I feel like I've heard as well. Eve ending 12. Really liked the last one ending 11. Um, I've liked all of these. I think TK's, Amos, and Vaughn as well as Maximum the Hormones. I feel like those are my four favorites. Um, unsurprisingly, because I'm familiar with their music as well. Uh, Vaughn actually, I discovered through Chainsaw Man and fucking love them. Um, but yeah, incredible. Amos might actually be my number one, you know. Um, that song is awesome. I can't wait to hear the full version. So, should we jump into the last one? Ending 12, Eve? Or should we just skip it and move on? Should we skip it? All right, fine. We'll skip uh, Of course, we're going to react to it. <laughs> Those ice creams look really nice. Here in the UK, we call those milk pops or something like that. I might be wrong. Milksicles? Milk pops? It's like a milk ice cream. Um, it's actually lovely. I don't know what everyone else in the rest of the world calls it. It's like a milkshake ice cream and you get them on like a little thing. But they're fucking delicious, by the way. I just thought I'd pause to let all of you know. I, I like them. They're very nice. <laughs> When you compare this ending, the animation of this ending with Vaughndies, for example, uh, it looks like two completely different shows.
this. That looks like my kind of night. That looks like my kind of good time. Everyone just sitting around a table, eating food, because I love eating food. Eating food is awesome. Eating food is amazing. Sitting around a table, eating food. I want to, you know what? I want to do a meetup one day, either in the UK or US, and just do something like this. Get loads of people together, sit down, just have, rent out a place, rent out a room in the place or something like that. Maybe like a golf place. I don't know. I'd have to work out how the hell like you should do a meetup. I don't really know how you do them. <clears throat> I never thought I'd be in a position where I'd be able to do one. It's strange. As, to me, I still feel like I've got two subscribers. <laughs> I'm not even joking. Um, I still feel like I've got two subscribers. It's happened so quickly. It's all happened. It's, it's, it just feels strange. Um, but yeah, I'd love to meet some of you guys. And this, this is how you do it. I want to replicate this. This looks like my kind of good time. Everyone just sitting around a table, getting really fat, really full, just chilling, having some nice drinks, and then literally just like passing out i wonder if there's a i wonder if there is a restaurant in the uk i can rent out that you can sleep in that's what i want <laughs> i want like comfy pillows and beds all around the table i want everyone to get off the pillows and beds go to the table eat at the table and then i don't know like a big screen comes down as some anime is played or something and we all just chill on the beds and, and the cushions around the table and everyone just watches tv and falls asleep there with huge full be full bellies that sounds incredible right that sounds like the best time ever is it just me food Comfiness and TV. Ah, that's amazing. I want that. I want that so bad. Someone, someone let me know. I want to make that happen. Um, anyway, this was awesome. <laughs> this was awesome. I've been so excited to make this video. Oh, man, so excited. I've been dying to make this video for so long. The Chainsaw Man endings. Literally, since this, since this show came out, people are losing their minds about it. I, like, I still don't consider myself an anime fan. Because I haven't watched many, right? I've, I've, I haven't finished any animes. I haven't like done any. We're just watching Attack on Titan at the moment. Um, I've technically finished Arcane, but it's still ongoing. And I don't think that counts as an anime. Uh, we've started Cyberpunk Edge Runners, which apparently is a Japanese anime. So that when I finish that, that'll be my first anime I've finished. Um, that like first like caught up to. <clears throat> We're gonna watch Silent Voice on Twitch. Uh, actually, on Sunday. Uh, by the way, if you want to come along to that, I'm going to be doing a live watch along to Silent Voice. I am also going to then watch the first episode to that time I got reincarnated as a slime. And then every Saturday following on, we're going to finish that show. So if you guys would like to be part of those watch alongs, uh, make sure you follow me on Twitch. Link in the description. This was so cool. Let me know what you guys think about me doing a full time, a full, full time, full time reaction. 24 7, 8 days a week. Um, a full reaction to... Um, uh, Aima and TK in one, or would you rather I just do like a normal one? Like I'll do a reaction to TKs, I do a reaction to Aimers. Let me know what you guys want. Either way, I'll be listening to those songs uh, 100%. The show just looks so weird. It looks weird, wonderful, and wacky. The three W's. It looks great. It looks really cool. It looks really strange. I've heard brilliant things about it. I'm very curious to watch it. Um, is Chainsaw Man the one people are saying the ending needs to be rewritten? Why? Like, <laughs> I, I swear that's Chainsaw Man, isn't it? <laughs> Is that the one people are saying the ending needs to be written or something like that? Um, honestly, I, I feel like you guys all just need to learn to be disappointed. Um, speak it from someone. I met, How many of you are Game of Thrones fans? But then again, actually saying that, um, I w it would have been really cool if they rewrote the ending to Game of Thrones. That would have been pretty cool. So I can kind of see where some people are coming from. But I don't know enough about this to be on anyone's side. So um, be civil in the comment section. Be nice to each other. Uh, because I don't know nothing, and I, I might be completely wrong in saying this. I just saw some articles about it. But anyway, regardless, I'm fucking watching this show. 100%. The second we are done with Cyberpunk Edge Runners, pay, uh, Patre Patreon, Chainsaw Man will become the Patreon exclusive reaction. Um, every week, there will now be a Patreon exclusive anime series running. Cyberpunk Edge Runners was our start. And uh, next will be Chainsaw Man, and then it will go on and on and on. And there will usually be single season animes. Uh, just that way we're not dedicating too much time uh, to a one episode a week series. It will always be every single Friday, every week. So we start with Arcane. Arcane is finished. Arcane was originally supposed to be our first Patreon exclusive. However, everyone kicked off and said, no, please put it on YouTube. And I was like, fine, I'll put it on YouTube, but the next one will be Patreon exclusive. Uh, due to the adult content on cyberpunk i can't actually even put it on youtube if i wanted to hence why it's on patreon and then chainsaw man i've heard again has very similar style especially with the gore so that again can't really be on youtube because i'll be patreon and all the animes to follow will be of a similar sort of style you know like not really youtube friendly whether they've got nudity or intense gore they will then go on patreon 
So let me know. First, are you guys looking forward to me watching Chainsaw Man? I can't wait. And second, what's an anime you think would make a good Patreon exclusive series? And anyone wondering about the price? Patreon is set to a dollar only and it will never increase in price. Um, so you can pay what you want. You can pay more. But the lowest amount you have to pay is one dollar. And that's the lowest Patreon would let me set up. But anyway, links for everything is in the description. And I hope you all enjoyed this reaction. I cannot wait to watch this series. And I cannot wait to hear the full version of a lot of these songs. Chainsaw Man looks like the weirdest thing I've ever seen. And I just can't wait to see it. I can't wait to see it for myself. And see if it meets all the hype that the openings and the endings have already set for me. Along with all of you. Anyway, I hope everyone in the world you have a wonderful weekend and a happy new year to all of you. Thank you very much for making this year one of the best years of my life. I really would be nothing without all of you. If you watch this far through and you haven't subscribed, you're crazy. Subscribe. Get yourself entered into that giveaway when we hit 300,000 subscribers and get yourself $1,000. Make sure you're subscribed. If you're not and we hit 300k, you won't be entered. That's simple. So make sure you subscribe. Play it safe. Other than that, have an awesome day. And as always, my friends, you see me in the next video.